Hello, my name is Barbara Robinson and welcome to the basic wire work video. In today's video, you're going to learn what I call the closed circuit wrap wire technique. With this technique, you'll be able to create bracelets, earrings, necklaces, whatever you want. Isolate across the loop, then I'm going to bring the tail up just enough to be able to add my little silver lobster clasp. Also in the video, after you learn the basic technique of the closed circuit, I'm going to show you a few tips and tricks. We're going to add what I call a soldered jump ring between so your bracelet will flow just a little bit nicer or necklace. And then I'm going to show you how to add pieces of chain between um, your gemstones or pearls or whatever you decide you want to put in your piece of jewelry. And then we're also going to cover earrings and how to put drops to your necklace. So it's going to twist back. And that opens that loop up just enough to be able to bring this in and slide it and you can see it's trapped on there. Then I'm just going to reach with my pliers and now I'm going to rotate that just like we rotated our wire back toward my body like so. Here are some samples to give you a little bit extra inspiration. I went ahead and wire wrapped a large lamp work bead here. On the, bottom, on the bottom of the wrap, I attached three pieces of chain and then wrapped crystals and beads on the end of this here. And then I just linked chain using the wire wrap technique of the beads and the crystals between. This bracelet here was wire wrapped using the head pin technique. All it was was a piece of chain with a clasp on the end of it for a bracelet and then every component that you see on here was put on a head pin and I just filled it in until it was nice and fluffy and full. This is the pearl bracelet that we made in the video with just linked between. This is the Labradorite bracelet that we made using the closed jump rings, soldered closed jump rings in between. This is the garnet necklace we made with the wire in between. And then on this bracelet, when I wrapped, I stacked a garnet, a pearl, a garnet, and then linked it with the closed rings. Here on the head pins, I did tourmaline and cultured pearls from Japan. On this head pin, I put pearls and tanzanite, and I used little bally gold spacers. And on this earring, I wrapped the pearl, I did the dangle, with the wire and the pearls wrapped on the end. And this is just a plain chain. I went ahead and stacked the beads on a head pin and wire wrapped them onto a plain chain that I turned into a necklace. Hope some of these samples here inspire you and most of all, have some fun.